Hi, my name is Shalom Israel Kamu. And my name is Nathaniel Adonai Kamu. It was a cold September morning of 1814. The War of 1812 was in progress. Earlier that August, the British bombed the White House. Their next target? The important port city of Baltimore. More importantly, Fort McHenry. Francis Scott Key was aboard a ship, just eight miles away from the fort. He was heading there to negotiate the release of his friend, Dr. William Beans, as he had been taken prisoner by the British. And from that ship, Key witnessed rocket fires, foggy explosions, and what seemed like a total destruction of that fort. He was witnessing the climax of the War of 1812, a war which had so far lasted over two years. The British were forced to retreat. And after all that bombardment, Francis Scott Key saw that the American flag, with its red and white stripes, still stood victoriously. It was then that Francis Scott Key wrote his famous and passionate poem, The Defense of Fort McHenry. This poem was later set to a tune, and in 1931, President Wilson declared it the national anthem. This poem is now known as the Star-Spangled Banner, which we will now sing. Oh, say.